Hi, this is Mike Haber. Thanks for asking me, why would I need an ignition interlock device or an IID? Getting pop for DUI is the hands down most common reason for an IID, but there are other possible explanations. For instance, you could be a masochist, or perhaps your parent or your guardian or your loved one, or even your employer is concerned and they want to ensure sober driving in their car. There's nothing that prevents a private citizen from installing an IID into their vehicle. But again, almost universally, if there's an IID in your car, then it's probably been court ordered to be there or DMV has required you to install it in order to maintain a valid driving license, or both. With the exception of a first DUI where your breath reading is under 0.15, in Florida, if you're convicted of DUI, then the court must, by statute, order installation of an IID device for a period of time. If it's your first DUI and your breath is above 0.15, the IID requirement is a minimum of six months. On a second with breath below 0.15, it's a minimum of a year, and above 0.15, it's two years. On a third, it's a minimum of two years regardless of breath, and on a fourth or more, it's a minimum of five years. Even if your DUI case occurred in another state, Florida DMV can require you to install an IID. Why? Because you have no right to drive in Florida, or in any other state for that matter. Driving is a privilege, not a right. And Florida DMV treats all DUI cases as if they had occurred right here in Florida. So if you want to drive in Florida, you're going to be subject to the Florida IID standards that I mentioned above. Incidentally, this is going to hold true for any of the mandatory DUI penalties and not just IIDs. The bottom line with Florida DMV is that dealing with them is very much like struggling against a rip current. If you swim with it, your survival chances increase. If you fight it, you're likely to drown. That said, I thank you for your question. I appreciate your having asked it, and I invite you to ask me more. Please remember that at Haber PA, it's all about reasonable doubt. And if you like this video, then please subscribe to our channel. We'll be putting out more soon.